Time now for another check on our weather. Meteorologist Vanessa Murdoch is back with another look at our forecast. You say we have two chances to get hit tomorrow with some pretty severe weather. Yeah, morning and night, and in between, more of an isolated mm. activity. But definitely the morning commute could be a slow roll tomorrow. Torrential rain could lead to isolated flooding, and you know what that does, just backs up traffic. So not only a more expensive commute now, but a soggy one for your Monday. We have a red alert in effect tomorrow. Live outside right now, enjoy it while it lasts. A beautiful and warm evening out there. 81 degrees right now in the park, but beautiful. Your headlines, a red alert tomorrow. The storms will linger Tuesday, but in much less significant fashion. And then on Wednesday, calm and warm. Beautiful midweek forecast for us. Precip chances as we make our way in toward the midnight hour. We could see a little bit of action north and west of the city, but the main event is tomorrow during the wee hours of the morning and again tomorrow evening. Tuesday, especially early in the day, we could see some lingering action. Wednesday, the forecast is dry. Then late Thursday into Friday, a return chance for showers and storms. If you've liked the comfortable air mass that's been in play, well, things are about to change. Tomorrow and Tuesday, humidity levels become oppressive, tropical even, if you will. Wednesday, much more comfortable again before things tick back up on Thursday. And temperature-wise, we're going to see a big drop-off tomorrow because of the significant, significant cloud cover and also the ramped-up chances for rain to just keep those temperatures more subdued. And then by Wednesday, we're back to seasonable and above at 87. Out there right now at 77 in the Hamptons, we have 85 in Sparta, 86 in Edison, and 79 in Brick. We're watching on the satellite and radar picture as round one makes its approach, but it is still hours away. It's really after 3 a.m. that the main event rolls in through for your morning commute. And then tomorrow night into early Tuesday, it's the storm system out here. And then after that, we'll get to enjoy high pressure momentarily. As far as severe thunderstorm activity is expected, we are just on the cusp for an incredibly high risk for severe weather. That's going to be for the southern edge of Jersey, but we still have plenty of opportunities to see damaging wind, hail, as well as an isolated tornado tomorrow. And as for the risk for flooding rains, well, it is about a 20% chance across most of the viewing area that we'll see some flash flooding tomorrow from these storms. The breakdown of your day, again, morning rush could be affected by the rainfall, the storm, 72. It's going to be a soggy and slow commute likely. By midday, a little low, 79, but still some isolated activity. And then for sunset, and beyond tomorrow, another line of strong storms pushed through. In fact, I think severe storms are even more likely tomorrow evening as far as highs go. We're going to get into the mid-80s for Jersey, but we'll be in the 70s to the north and east of the city. Your extended forecast, Tuesday, still a chance for storms, 85. For Thursday, 86 with, excuse me, Wednesday, 87 with sun. Thursday, we're looking at 86, a late chance leading into Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, all of which look to be a little bit more of that summer steam and storm activity. Interesting week ahead. Yes, All it right. will be. Thank you so much, Vanessa.